that this is the Norman Rockwell of of uh, the 21st century. This is Norman Rockwell and Jackson Pollock in one right here. Uh, and he's a patriot, a true patriot, and we love that about you, man. How you doing? Are you are you going around the country uh, doing? No, nah, I've been you, just local, just yeah, doing yeah. so much. I got so many projects I'm working on right now, and uh, obviously, you know what I did yesterday. Wait, what? You don't know what I did yesterday? What happened? What I miss? You got a picture of what I did? Oh. Uh, it should. We should. Yes. <clears throat> We're punching it up now. I drove this. It's uh, in all the papers. Oh, well. this is great. This is Ten great. Ten foot by <laughs> twenty-two foot. Double-sided mobile billboard throughout Manhattan with Trump with the muscles. The one I have in my office. But it says Trump 2020. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I, I, listen, I drove that through Manhattan. That's great. Well, how did I miss this? <laughs> this is the news, Frankie, right there. The number one news no, story. It, yeah, it's no, all listen, in the paper. This it was, is great. Yeah, it, was, it was in a couple of media outlets. You know why it wasn't in this all of them? Because great. it was pro-Trump. If it was Trump, anti-Trump, yeah. I'd oh, be oh, world news. Oh, oh. World news. So wait, so you oh. hold this. Which it's a, this is like the size of a trailer, a tractor trailer. It says, keep America great, Trump 2020. With a picture of, and that picture I have, of Donald Trump with one. jacked up forearms. Just, you know, the it's people, great. listen, it's for me to drive that, the Goyons I had to have yeah. to drive that thing around in this city. The, it, one, one, listen, one drive, of the best crawl yeah. with this traffic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that was the That's beauty even of better, it. right? Because yeah, you're you, going slow, and it's right well, in your you, face. You got to tell me people how to be cheering, though. Go for it. You listen, know what I mean? Huh? The, we're in New York City, pal. That's why I drove it around here. Art is to provoke emotion, and brother, did I provoke emotion. <laughs> were they yelling at you? Did yelling. They... Somebody threw a plate of food at it, we, but we had a power washer. <laughs> To clean it, there was spit on it. One, oh, this one lady, the best was. Oh, I drove, hold on, you don't know where I went. <laughs> I drove it around Alec Baldwin's apartment. <laughs> you are nuts! Wait, you are nuts! Listen, I swear then to I God. pulled up. I don't right even know where front. Alec lives. You know, yeah. ah, we keep that location. Yeah, okay, it's okay. public knowledge, but anyway. Yeah. Then the best That's is I stunning. park it in front of the Tribeca Grill, which Robbie. De oh owns. my. <laughs> Gosh, gosh. We were out there for like 20 minutes. And let me tell you something. I didn't see him. I was like, you know, hey, Bobby, come on. You in there? Come on out. But anyway, everybody in the restaurant was looking. And the looks I got, one woman had foam coming out of her mouth. <laughs> Get this out of my neighborhood. This is a, you should not, you cannot have this. And I said, lady, this is a public street. I'm an artist. I'm just going around with my artwork. Oh, it was. Uh. The greatest time I, I had, the greatest time, and then we're driving down to it. We, we parked in front of City Hall, in front of you know, hey, De Blasio, come take a look at what a real president looks like. Uh, but it was just, what was the truck? Know, what was the truck? What were you? What was it was the a friend of mine has this. Um, a friend of mine, Nick, he he has a billboard company that travels with this. It's a big yeah, trailer. Yeah, yeah. yeah so it's you know, a flatbed yeah. with the with the picture yeah, on, a, on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. yeah. It's a professional made, you know, and they, they I get these things oh printed up. You know, gosh, I raised a couple bucks. Do you have video? Do you have any video of it? I got we, tons of video. Yeah, footage. send the video. We'd love to put that out there. That's it. I got to put it all together because I had two security retired cop friend of my, excuse me, and his buddy behind us the whole time with a dash cam. Yeah. Again, you don't know what's going to happen. You know, I'm in hostile territory. But you know this what? This isn't in the middle of America. But you're, one, you're one of the nicest guys I know, man. I see you in Staten Island. You're a Staten Island guy. And you know what? You're you're a giving guy. Somebody tore down a, a, a Trump sign. You put one back up. The president called you, yeah, yeah. and it was great. And, and and you know, if somebody goes with a De Blasio sign, if somebody's going to go with a with a Elizabeth Warren sign, I'm not going to hate them. I'm not going to. No, hate, I, no. honestly, they, I just, forget it. I got more middle fingers and. <laughs> This F U F, you know, but, all but, day. But fun, kind of. It would no. Some of it was really Foamy. aggressive. I mean, there was a couple of times. Thank God, I had the cameras on and I had my security. There was a couple of guys that were like, they were ready to, and but let, me, was, let me stop. But right most there. of it, let, let me you know, yeah, right please, what you're please. saying is, um, most of it was you know hatred towards it. But there was so many people who I knew they hated Trump, but they got a kick out of the. Goyons that yeah, I had yeah, to try yeah, this around that. the Lower East Village. You know, there was a couple of gay guys that were walking by, and they just looked at me like, "That's disgusting," but that's funny. Yeah, they you know, got so it. So there was some, you know, again, if if somebody drove Hillary Clinton billboard around my neighborhood, I would do the same thing. I would probably give the finger, but then I would also like, yeah. That's that's ballsy. Yeah, the hate's you know? got to go aside, man. I always keep saying that. What, what's with the hate? What's with the viciousness? Why do they get so fired up against this president? You it's think? because they lost. It'll be 
50 years from now, and they'll still be just as aggravated only because they lost. And I'm not just talking about the citizens that voted. I'm talking about the talking heads on all of these, you know, these yeah. major, you yeah. know, these journalists yeah. on, yeah. like, on, you yeah. know, the crazy news network. Yeah. They are so upset with themselves yeah. that yeah. they were Maybe. wrong. Maybe, huh? You know, Maybe. that yeah. they were wrong because they're, they're, I'm the news network, so I am definitely, I know more than anybody. Nobody knows more than me because I travel the country and I listen to the people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yep, the yep. whole problem is, and nobody talks about it. it, I traveled the country and I met everybody and they were all just fed up with, we went too left is what happened. The mm. society went too left. Mm. You can't go too left. They yeah. went too left, too fast, too hard. Yeah. And middle America, yeah, okay, yeah, which yeah, is the gears yeah, of this whole yeah, country. Yeah. They said, no, we yeah. don't care who you sleep with. We don't care who comes to this country. We don't care. They just want to work 16 hours a day, pay their mortgage, feed their kids. They don't care. But when you jam it down their throats, mm. we have Donald Trump as the president of the United States. And yeah. we will again in 2020. Yeah. Hence the sign. <laughs> you just... <laughs> You gonna take it out again? Wait, oh, wait. you kidding me? Yeah. I'm gonna take it to DC. <laughs> oh. I already got people in Boston want me to take it up to Boston, uh, but I'm making one like <sighs> five times the size of that to unveil <laughs> off a building. <laughs> I'm trying to find a building in Queens to unveil it by oh. AOC's office. Stop it! Right across. Stop from it! Rock. That's great. Can you do? Can you? Can you, do you, you have uh, sights on the building? I no, get, I got. I'm looking. I'm trying to reach out to the Trump family prom- because they own all. They're from the Queens. Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah. They're from Queens. They got to have a building right across the street. Do Do they have a? Do you have to get a permit for that sort of thing? Do you? Think? Nah. Well, there's a touchy line because I, I'm, you know, I'm an artist, so it's considered yeah, art. Yeah. It's not in sign, so I would make it more artistic. Scott, you were the man. You were the man, buddy. We're, now you gotta, you gotta check out Scott Levito's art. I mean, as an artist, though. Yeah, I, everybody's like yelling at me. All these art people, like, you're not an artist. You're a signed painter. You're. The, I said, look, I'm an artist to provoke emotion. Yeah. It doesn't matter how yeah. I do it, whether yeah. I do it crayons or I print it out. Yeah. So, but you know, back to what you're saying, I, I am. An artist, I have all these beautiful paintings, the American flag that I do in different styles. And yeah. Everything. So you go to my website, you can check Gotta out my Gotta check artwork. it out. You know, ScottLobato.com. You... I'm telling you, it is the best patriotic art ever, ever. Well, thank you. So, since well, now, I'm doing it before, I'm... you know, I, I, there was a bunch of new artists that are doing the flag art now because it's in. But I was back in the 90s when nobody wanted the flag. Yeah, and thank I you. I was starting that. That's yeah. how I, so I'm a founding father in this creative patriotic movement, yeah, folks. Yeah. Hey, Scott, before we let you go, man, tell me your, your art background again. You told me about this. You didn't have formal training, right? No, I uh, just always, since a child. I always yeah. had the gift since a child, and little by little, and I just kept at it. And then uh, you know, back in the 90s, I went to go find myself in the big city here, yeah. and I saw such hatred towards America and patriotism back in the 90s. Be the back then. Yeah, and yeah. especially from the creative community. Community. Yeah, you know we should be the most patriotic yeah. because we get to express ourselves yes, exactly more than you. Right, and if you're in a country, by the way, to your point, if you're in another country, you're not allowed to do. You could draw a you... circle the wrong way in the That's country, right. and you get exactly your hands right. off. Exactly you right. Know? So I just jumped right on that. I said I got to bring this flag back to life through art, and yeah, and here I am. Yeah, it's great. And then if you're if you're listening and you're watching, I'm sure you have the video on your website. When yeah, you, my Facebook page. When you okay. you initiated this, you were the first guy to initiate to music. He paints the uh, well. I'm, I'm, Artists have been doing it since the cave days. Yeah, I mean, it's really, right? it's, been, it's been around forever, but I created the unveil. You know, so many artists paint. Because you, you look, you, he's got a full canvas. I'm telling, talking to you uh, on the radio, but a full canvas, and then there's red, white, and blue. You see different things. Yeah, you can't. Like, that's my Jackson Pollock in three yeah, minutes yeah, of music. And then at the very end, very I un- peel down this tape that I had previously painted something. Yeah. So it's a double painting, and that's what blows people out of the water at yeah. the end of the show. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, great, he painted this beautiful flag, rah, rah. But then I peel down to like to the me. last note of the song. It's sensational, and man. It's I, fir- I first saw it in front of 35,000 people at yeah. the Tunnel to Towers. Yeah, or, or, you know, hopefully it'll be either this year, uh, September 29th. Uh, September 29th, right after Frankie's uh, wedding, right? We're going to be at uh, Tunnel to Towers, uh, and we're going to be there, and hopefully Scott Labato will be there. Scott, you the man. We're going to be online, scottlabato.com. Is that where we are? Yep, yep, yep. All right, great stuff, yeah. man. Hey, thanks for the courage. You know what? Everybody's got to relax. You just, I, that's why I like to have a... Yeah, but I am, you know, I am out there to not instigate in a little <laughs> way, you know, just to get a reaction. Again, it's art. Art creates a reaction. Yeah. And damn it, do I know how to do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do, man. It's Staten Island's finest, but there's Scott Labeda right there. He's a patriotic artist and activist. God bless you, man. Thanks for coming in, my brother. Always a pleasure, man. Yeah. Love you, Joey. Love you too, man. Uh, just some great stuff. It's a 9:49 with Piscopo in the morning. Debbie Duhame is out there on the road.